The Division of the Guyana Fire Service has been taking the hands-on approach to extinguish the burning municipal dump site in New Amsterdam. Latani Schulz reports. A fire that started at the municipal dump site at the corner of Esplanade Road has been burning since Monday the 18th of September 2023. The Guyana Fire Service would have responded on the day that the fire started and efforts are still ongoing to extinguish the fire. The thick smoke which can be seen from a distance has been affecting the lives of residents and students in the area and it is also an environmental hazard to surrounding flora and fauna. Mr. Shannon Crawford, the station officer attached to the Guyana Fire Service Station at B Division, was on the scene of the fire and spoke to this newscast. Yeah, this, um, this landfill fire, this would have started um, six Monday. We would have been here, we would have responded with our resources from the Amsterdam Fire Station. We would have been here every day to um, and soak in the dump site. However, this fire is, is continuous and there's a lot of smoke affecting the, neighbor, the residents of New Amsterdam. Mr. Crawford spoke about the attempts being made to extinguish the fire. So what we are attempting to do now, of course there is a shortage of water in the neighbor area. We need a lot of water. There is a shortage of water. Because of the extended dry season, the water is very low in the canals. So what we are attempting to do now in collaboration with the Mayan Town Council and the Regional Democratic Council Region Number 6, we would have did, um, if we would have observed, we would have did two pond, right? we would have did two pond in the two nearby um, canal that is low. So we did this pond deep and with gravity flow, the, the, the water will fill those ponds. And then we're going to be pumping from this pond into our truck, into the appliance. And once we have that water going, that pumping going, we're going to then do continuous soaking of the dump site. Right? He also explained why the fire has been so difficult to extinguish. The fire is um, undermined. It is undermined on the, on the dump site. It will burn continuously because the fire is smoldering. This will be called a smoldering fire. Okay. And the fire is undermined. So the only way we, uh, re relief is going to come, or the only way we will see some relief is when we do continuous soaking of this, um, this area. So this is what we're going to be um, doing here for the, uh, for the continuously until, um, until some semblance of relief is um, or some control is brought to this, uh, this situation. The station officer spoke about the efforts made since the Guyana Fire Service responded on Monday. I wouldn't say this is this is um, last resort because um, as, it, as the nature of firefighting is that you will try all strategy to um, arrest the spread of, um, of a fire. So I wouldn't say this is last resort, but this is this is what's been attempted now. So we would have, we would have came here and we would have used our Desilt the with the help of the region and the council, we have to desilt the canals, deep trench it more into more deep. So choose an, an area in the canal, in the very low canal, and to farm a pond, right? Hoping that the not open, the surrounding water will then go into that pond. And then we're gonna use our suction into those ponds and pump water onto the truck. Mr. Crawford then shared the plans for the following days. Today we will make an assessment when this exercise is completed. For how long we will be pumping here for probably for the next few hours, right, providing that there is water available. And then we have to be, we have to be returning around. 
only contingency until we have some relief, until the fire is extinguished. Lastly, Mr. Crawford told this reporter about the progress made since the fire started. Yeah, yeah um, there has been um, at, some, at some stage when we um, would have applied our water, there would have been some relief, then the intensity of the fire would have been um, raised again, right? The spray water then will relieve and the intensity of the fire raised again. So it's like that. As I said before, the fire is undermined. The fire is a dumb site. Right? And where really there is a dumb site, you will have um, it built up of gas because of the amount of garbage that would have been thrown into the dump site for over a period of time. So there is a built up of, of gases in the, on the dump site. So that dump site there um, is fuel for the fire. So the, as I said before, our strategy is to keep soaking. The Guyana Fire Service would have made an assessment of the municipal dump site after soaking the area for a few hours on Thursday the 22nd of September 2023 and will be returning during the upcoming days to soak the area until the fire is extinguished. Reporting for Channel 8 News, I am Lutani Shulls.